Yo! Video games. I have a fond, I have a very, I had very, very, very fond memories of the secret of Nim. In theaters? Yes. And... I don't, I don't know, Mac. Are you sure? I think that's before our time. I think that came out in 85. You would have been like two. <laughs> uh, I do remember, like, very fond memories of Secret and Nim. Very fond memories of, uh... Call the elevator, Junior. Of that movie, and then I watched it again recently, because Jessica, I told Jessica how much I, I loved it, and I... When I watched it again, that movie did not fucking age well. It's... It's a nonsensical piece of shit. It's a nonsensical <laughs> piece of shit. <laughs> it looks good. No, 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 it does look good. Like, it's it's actually... I actually saw it for the first time on great a few Don years Bluth ago. movie. Yeah. And I liked the animation right, and background. But it makes no sense. Yeah, you know, not really. Like, even when you, you do know what's going I mean, on, it's still kind of just like... I think we're stuck in the elevator. Okay, like... some help. I don't know, like, it stuck. feels like well, belittled in the end, because they're just like, really all it does is boiling down to is some rats stuck. going from a near a farmhouse yeah. to not living near a farmhouse. Yeah, it's, and it's uh, like this fucking, like, Lord of the Rings, the Game of Thrones-esque thing, all built around just rats going 50 feet. Yeah, um, exactly. I love American Tale, though. I, th I don't think I've ever seen American Tale in full. Wow. Still. Wow. One and two are both good, but two's, like, colorful and, and higher production, like, different. Suck it, Slimer. One's great, because one's got some fucking no, scary-ass fucking shit in the first movie, because, um... Come on. American Tale oh, Jesus basically Christ. is a mouse version of, like, um... When, when uh, communism took over Russia... And all these like like Jewish immigrants were trying to escape Stalin in his death camps, who by the way killed more more Jews and more people in his death camps than the, the Nazis did. Yeah, but anyway, so God, the beginning of that movie's like fucking nuts because they're in Russia, and they're talking about moving to America for a better life, and the fucking the Stalin Russian armies are represented by cats. And, but they're they're fucking demonic looking cats. Like they're I gotta Don, see this film. They're Don Bluth evil as shit cats. They just burst in or just like fucking giant demonic hate machines out to fucking murder yeah, everything. For some reason Don always it's had scary cats. as shit. Always looking. had cats as the bad guys. Yeah. And then like when they're on this ship coming to America, like Fifo gets tossed overboard and he ends up in like a, a bottle. In the ocean, and the ocean like yeah, turns into this big fucking like mon phantasm yeah, monster. So like the, what's what he sees is a waste. It's like Don Bluth literally probably enjoy got physical pleasure out of like scaring the shit out of children. I believe I am firmly committed to that. And even if you didn't like it, you couldn't help but fucking watch. Yeah. Because I am desperately trying to aim my fucking stream. I'm trying to focus my stream onto this ghost's face. Fuck. Wait to their eyes, kid. Fuck! Look behind you! Look behind you, Ray! Watch this, watch this. Snipe streams. Snipe streams. And you win. <laughs> Ray, follow me. The others are floating back upstairs. Begman, you two pull our friend Slimer into a trap as fast as you can. Yeah, if you ever want to see like in these spikes <laughs> indicating this isn't just It's a pretty good film. I'd say American Tales is probably one of his better films. Up. It's got some really fucking cheesy dumb songs. Doesn't land before time. Also done. Yeah, with. the first one, yeah. not, not thirteen after that or whatever. But <laughs> no, like the first yeah. one was. And that movie was kind of dark too. Like you see the mom get fucking killed by a T Rex. That's I do remember that. That's pretty traumatizing. I'll bet the beef brisket is today's special. And you've done quite enough already. I'm sure the thing will just go away. Yeah, that's how things work in this in these games. Willing to risk it. You're not going Did he said he's willing to risk it? That's all we needed to hear. Alright, we're out. Coffee time, everyone. Service has been declined. Oh god, coffee sounds so good right now, Vank. <laughs> god damn it, Vank. Did I upgrade yet? Bell hop boost. Mm-hmm. So fast trap, slam dunk trapping, this is all the different types of shit that we can upgrade. Mm-hmm. I don't have enough money for it. Hey, you do. You got 40. Oh, no, I have 467. Okay, I was looking at the wrong one. Yes. Ding. That cost 10 grand. Holy fuck. Yeah, a bunch of people are saying Don Bluth had a saying that kids can endure anything as long as there's a good ending. Well... 
The thing is, Red Letter Media had a great saying about this, is that old movies, like 90s and 80s kids' movies, had some scary fucking shit in it. Yeah. Like some genuinely scary things. And now most kids' movies are like Alice in Wonderland and uh, Wizard of Oz and... That's where they, they were reviewing Wizard of Oz, and they're like, no, nothing ever feels like it's in danger in yeah. those films. It's always just like, it, like there's never really a sense of anything scary. And they, they mention how things are scary in the old games, and why is it bad that a kid is scared of some yeah. shit? Yeah, like there was, should be there was even shit. some slight edge to some of the Disney stuff in the, the 80s. Because right they had that movie, The Great Mouse Detective, and at, the, and, yeah. and at the very end, when he's fighting uh, Vincent Price, yeah. he like he hulks out a bit. And they do all this weird shadowing effects. We basically like turns into like this giant monster, and he's just beating the shit out of the main character okay. on Big Ben. Champion. And it, he looks like monstrous kind of thing. And then like uh, the Oliver and Company, like the, the main bad guy, like he he's kind of scary because he has like this big ass car, and he he pulls out a fucking gun at the end, like he's going to shoot the main characters. Don't touch the slime. It's slime. And then he gets run over by a fucking train. <laughs> like head on, and it, it's like yeah, I'm okay with things actually being fucking Jesus, things actually being scary. Forty dollars, oh, Waffle. What's up, dude? Thank Waffle. you very much, Waffle. Waffle. That, was, that was very loud. Waffle. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to tone that shit down slightly. Thank you very much, dude. We watch it now. Fucking nothing to worry about. Most kitchens have self-starting power. Hands up. Class one caustic what? Caustic seep. Meat. Bread. It's bread. Yeast. 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 Is <laughs> that <Yeast. laughs> like where a bunch of fish coats come at you? Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna cook up the eggs. Wow. Now they're delicious. Oh, look at this fucking guy. Suck it, asshole. Okay, I dare you. Everything but the kitchen sink. Oh, this game is fucking great. It's just as good as it used to be. And now we're playing at 60 frames per second on Glorious PC Master Race. It's even better. This is $10 on Steam, guys. Fucking well worth it. Potentially, potentially on Halloween night, if I'm not mystically doing anything that evening, I hope the servers are still up for this shit. I'll go online and blast ghosts with people. <laughs> with like four player. Must make you feel good. Must it makes me feel good. That's all there is to it. You just throw this junk anywhere. <laughs> we don't stick around and clean up. What's down here, Pete? Pete Vank, what's down here? Knives on the wall and shit. Ooh. Hey. Stay puff. Cursed artifact. <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck. That, Meat. That, that can't be right. Meat. That can't be right. Meat. You gotta shoot it, Max. Okay, I'm gonna. Okay. Meat. <laughs> it's exactly what I wanted. <laughs> Meat. Oh, I, that cost me $188. No bueno. I should probably stop just toasting random shit. That must have been some deliciously expensive bread. Check it. <laughs> Simmons, yeah, you should have said dead bird. Uh, dead bird. Look at uh, another one right there. Bird. Racking up that damage, huh? Well, it didn't. It didn't cost me anything. Hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. The light probably will. Maybe. But what I don't want to do is. Did Pete just like destroy? <laughs> he just ran through it and destroyed it. It totally looks like someone like had an explosive diary on the wall. He's happy. <laughs> <laughs> He's happy. Fucking Max. Explosive diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> That's the story I was telling you of that guy farting Shot on his dogs. <laughs> Shotgun blast. <laughs> he shotgun blasted shit right out of the wall. <laughs> oh, there's this amazing story on Reddit of a guy that ca like, casually farts no, on his I dogs and he shits <laughs> down his leg fiercely oh, one day. Oh, Natal! Oh, 1884! Project Natal, thank you very much, dude.
Nom, nom, nom. Would it kill him to mix in a green salad once in a while? I'm gonna take backup. Blast him until he's dazed, and then throw your capture stream. Roger, Fink! Food fight. God, why are people bringing up food fight? Jesus Christ. Food fight? You mean that the, the John Tron review movie? Yes. Oh, that's a great film. <laughs> that's a great film. I the, I don't want to see it, but I I I do just want to see the full full clips of Christopher Lloyd's character in it. <laughs> it's just that fucking spazzed out fucking drug addict guy like. That's very weird. Yeah, that's the only thing I want to see. I just want to see Christopher Lloyd like completely losing his goddamn mind. Which reminds me. There is a good, fake good. trailer. Oh shit. Are you a bird? I'm Hermes. Are you a bird? Are you a bird? Well, no. Then die! <laughs> uh, thank you, Bird of Hermes, for that. We appreciate it. Got this bitch. You gotta wear him down. Slimer, quit being a fuck. Thank you! <laughs> you had a couple of really fucking generous dudes. Thank you so much tonight, guys. I'm trying to get my Slimer in here. With my stream. My particle stream. Slimer! What the fuck? He escaped at the very end. I do really like the screaming, I'm not gonna lie. Perfect. See? That's a big wow. I will teach that pitiful <coughs> goop sack to slime Pete England. And by extension, you. Uh, this place is trashed. <laughs> Perhaps a place sitting disturbed? Still pretty much ready. Full go for the Rodriguez blowout. The Alhambra Ballroom. The Bar Mitzvah. What have you done? The guests are arriving in 15 minutes. What seems to be your problem? Thanks to me and my new exclusively assigned recruit here, the festivities can now proceed in an entirely ghost-free environment. So, you're welcome, huh? And, uh, to the Rodriguez? Blachaim. Blachaim. Yes, we're gonna go see Kenny tonight at, uh, at Halloween Horror Nights. Oh, my lovely... It's gonna be fantastic. You might see us on Jurassic Park. Nice of you guys to there are no cats in America. The streets are filled with cheese. Well, they blind firing proton packs. Uh -oh. That's Hands awesome. Fuck! Holy oh, shit! Now give us a hand. We've got a couple of really persistent troublesome spirits here. Whatever you do, Spangler, don't. Oh god damn it! I ripped. His, I toasted his head. We should have friendly fire in this, where you can actually kill the shit out of people. <laughs> <laughs> Pete needs a medic. Where is he? Medic! He's behind you. Almost there. Uh oh. <laughs> Fucking Pete. Right. Hey, over here. A little help? Yo, a little help? Oh. Ow! Slime! It's a river of slime! Whoa! A little <laughs> drunk. That's the stuff. Gotta be at least 60,000 gallons of it down here. Oh. Yeah, we should watch Ghostbusters too. Nice probably streaming. like it. Hang of it. Good yeah, I gotta fucking wrangle this bitch. Get the trap out. Wrangle you into my trap, son. Oh, fuck. Somebody did the job for me. You got him on the ropes. Yeah, there's traps everywhere. Let's just use them. God oh, damn it, you fucking oh. ghost! That bellhop was having none of that. Aim high. Oh god, you away from me. Watch it, streams are crossed. Fuck! How many fucking bellhops died in this one? <laughs> <laughs> I love the excuse that they had earlier where it's like. What's with the new resurgence of ghosts? And, he's, and the Spangler's like, new people die every year. <laughs> I'm like, that's a great... this place a clean bill of health five years ago. New people die every year. <laughs> Wrangle this bitch. Slam him. 
Like, seriously, how, I mean, obviously when you're here it's unsafe, but I mean, how, generally speaking, how unsafe is the set of This is hotel? awesome, look at this shit! Oh, dude, this is ex- The way this game feels as well, like, the controls and the gameplay are fucking great. They did such a good job on this game. But yeah, I totally agree with you. <laughs> Fucking things. Who is going to pay for all of this? Hey, we kind of just sir, as you know, the look at this. <laughs> <like, laughs> yeah, let's just fucking. That's so good. Hey, hey, shut up. As well, so you're covered. Honestly, Hold on a sec. Hey, hey, perhaps we should just shut up. Here, if that's what you would prefer, sir. No, no, but please. Be discreet. Discretion is our professional watchword. Holy fucking shit! Whoa, where did he come from? I suppose we should go after him, unless you. That guy, that guy, first. that guy took off. Cadet, go with Dr. Spangler. Check out the anchor. Exguard! Thank you very much, Exguard! <laughs> Nothing. Siler 913! Welcome, guys. Thank you so much. Hopefully you're digging Ghostbusters at 60 frames per second and 1080p. No, they're having a large discussion about SWAT cats. SWAT cats? <laughs> That's good enough. I kind of like how your character's like generic, the generic mute dude. He's just a recruit. Can't get across there. Move. Take the lead. Take this trap. Take the lead. Take the trap. Smoke some J's. <laughs> Take my dogs. Take my cats. <laughs> Take my babies. Save me. <laughs> Save me. <laughs> you have any idea what that's from, man? It's really familiar sounding. Because I knew you were going to say save me in the end, and yeah. I don't know what the fuck it's from. There we go. You want to know? Yeah, tell me. Ren and Stimpy. Yes! Firehouse dogs. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. 